Hey everyone, you're okay. Welcome back to Let's Play Siren Head Awakening, where I'm dreading my existence and I did not want to come back here, but here we are. Okay, first things first, I do want to fix the brightness because for the sake of editing and also being able to see, I hate it. That's, it was all the way up? No, bullshit, I thought there was more. It's all the way up. Fine. Fine. I already know how it is. Alright, alright, alright. Speed run. Speed run. Let's go. There was once people who explored yada yada yada. Shut the fuck up. We gotta live. Skip. Don't ever show me this again. I told myself I didn't want to come back here and I meant it. I definitely meant it. Ooh. All right, we need to be looking. I won't be standing out in the open. We need to be looking beyond. That's already so fucking loud. There he is. Eve, queef, Eve, queef. Oh, at least we know where he is. Look at him. He's ugly as shit. Okay. He's going that way. We're going this way. We're gunning it. We know where to go. We know what to do. Fuck everything. Get in and get out. No. I was thinking about where the gas can is because that's what's next. And I was thinking if up oh, here, here. Where's that train? There's a car over there, just in case. No, it was right here. It was here. Oh. My god. No. Don't tell me that they spawn in different areas now. That it's random. No, no, next is over here at the little house. Or at the little- yes, in the yard. Yes, okay. We're fine. It's- I just skipped one. Ooh, thought I heard him. I need to be looking too. Oil canister, got it. We remember. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I hear him, he's on my left. He's coming this way. We're gonna wait for him to go that way. This direction, here. Do you see him anywhere? I don't. 
<gasps> Aw, man. Well, I thought it spawned one after the other. Because maybe I just wasn't paying attention the first time I did this. I get back in, get back in. Aha, paying attention now. Where'd he go? There he is. He's right in front of me. Right here. I think. I, I don't know. Hey, you can't camp, motherfucker. That's not fair. Yeah, keep walking, ugly. Keep. Walking. Go. Don't even, don't look at him. Just run. I think we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We know what we're doing. We're smart. Not me getting lost again. No, I know where I'm going. Don't care. Don't care. Keep running. Oh my god, my breathing startled me. Cut through. Like, why are we following the trail? Is it noisy? Is it noisy to go off the trail? Or is it just how dumbasses like me don't get lost? Shit. I hear the footsies. Do you see him? I hear him, but I don't know from what direction. He'll come eventually. He'll come through. We'll see him. And we'll go not in that direction. Um, okay. Watch him be walking. No, shut the fuck up. See, how come Siren Head gets mad when I fix my car and... How does he even know? That's him, that's him, that's him. Where'd he go? Y'all saw that, right? That was him. Yeah, there he is. Okay. Go. Step on it. This way. Ah, my finger slipped off the button. I still have my claws, in case you've been wondering. Oh, hell no. How fast can- I'm faster. I have to be. Why would stamina be limited if I- if I- <gasps> Woo! Did you saw? Did you see that? I see that. I see you. You sneaky bitch! I see you. Don't even try to play that shit with me, asshole. And we're walking the other way. Okay. 
I don't want to have to cut through. Fuck a duck. There he is. Okay. It's the backtracking for me. Bitch! <laughs> like, bitch, you chased me all the way back over here. Fuck you and your ugly feet. You're too close for comfort. It's already intense. Holy shit. Holy sh shit balls. Do you think? No, it would have said. It would have said if me running is making too much noise. Like, you know, in the beginning of the game when it said to turn off your flashlight, because he'll see you. Who? I can't even see with my flashlight because it points down when you run. We picked up the battery. We just need to find where he just went. Okay, so totally gunning it in the opposite direction doesn't necessarily lose him. He just kind of spawns in at random areas of the map, depending on where you enter. That has to be the case because there's no way in hell he circled back around me. In that amount of time. With his pace? Fuck no. Mm. There he is. Oh, peekaboo. Peekaboo is a thing. No more peekaboo. There's no way in hell. Let's keep going. That part isn't here. I like the idea of, see, Do you see that? Going the other way? Please, please get back. My finger keeps slipping because I am pressing down with the brute force of much anger. Okay, just walk. Have I circled back around? Am I finally back up to where the These trees spawning in. Yes, I have. I made it back. Okay. We need to find the gas can 
it's not where it was spawning in the last time that I played this. Damn. Damn. We proceed with severe caution and awareness of surroundings. Come on. Believe in you. You little running legs. Go. Let's just sit in safety for a second. Okay. Where are you, sweetie? Where the fuck are you? We're gonna find it. We're gonna find it. Again, proceeding the utmost amount of caution. And if we remember correctly, let's just go back. So I don't know if me putting in one of the last items left on the list, if he gets even more mad, you know? Okay, well then we're going this way. All right. And there's a road in between here and the second bus stop canopy. So we'll take that. Fuck, my breathing startled me. And we're walking the other way. Deja vu, am I right? Only this time, I don't have the magic item. I guess we're gonna take the long way around. That's what it looks like. It's gonna be like... So far, I think we're doing much better. In terms of anxiety, um, still pretty bad, but we're doing pretty good. Everything that's like, um, spawning in, I don't know where he is, that way, that way, that way, that way, fuck, no, 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 you don't get to do this to me, you do not get to do this to me again, I have almost all of my items, sir, and you are interrupting my process of escape, so fuck you. Oh my god, back here again. Oh, you were rather close, let me tell you. Fuck you and your ugly feet. Um, hello. You come here. I do wish to speak with you. Not really. You could fuck off for all I give a shit. <sighs> My pinky hurts. I jammed the fuck out of it today. I, um, yeah, just that. And it hurt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I... I hate to come back to this again, this conversation, but I feel I must... It's my screen, and just that it's so bright in here, I kinda can't... I can't function with this shit. 
let me try one more time. Okay, you're gonna have to forgive the lighting quality because I can't see. And if I start over because of blind spots due to the brightening bullshit of my lights, I whoa! <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna flip my shit if I die. Look at those ugly feet. You are ugly. Ugly, I say. Ugly. <coughs> Thank you. We're back to cutting corners. Because if he gets to spawn wherever the fuck he wants, I get to cut corners. Okay. So this time, what we'll do... We'll keep going this way. See if we could find that dome that has a, a, a chair in it. I didn't show that in my, one of my parts, but I found this uh, similar structure to hide in, like that dome. And it has a chair in it and a desk. Um, it had a note in it originally when I tried playing on normal. I really wish they would have kept the notes in baby mode because I would be interested in reading them, you know? Even though I'm on baby mode. Hey, partner, how you doing? We're gonna go down that way, okay? And you're gonna be okay with it, okay? Okay? Speaking of spawning... Oh, look, a jump! We've learned from that mistake, haven't we? That's the dome, isn't it? It has to be, because here's a car. And then remember in the first part, I don't know if I left it in, but I was saying about how, you know, oh, I can't, um... I can't hide in the vehicles and stuff. These are the vehicles I get to hide in. Not those crushed, ugly cars that I've been seeing everywhere. Alright, shut up. Um... You think we can make that? Where'd he go? Yeah, see? Here. We found it. It has a little desk, a chair, uh, the door closes. That's weird. A tire. You cannot come in. This is a, a human only party. Okay? Okay. No tall ass siren head looking bitches. Such as yourself. Get away from my dome. I just don't like that he could spot me in this big ass uh, train or little train cart thing, cargo part of the train. Cause he could like scoop me up from in here if he really wanted to like if he actually tried out of any of them really if he had actually tried he could add me okay let's um progress i guess in a quick manner Okay. So that's the road. Takes me back to the car. 
There is another little camp spot, like the one I ran into earlier, over there. Let's hope it's in there. If not, I think the- if it's not over there, the last place I'm gonna- I'm gonna check is that little trailer park, because it's the only one I haven't actually looked at yet. I've been going around it. Mostly because I assumed it wasn't gonna spawn there, because it hasn't in the past. No matter how many times I've died and tried again, everything has stayed the same. Maybe I went to the wrong one, because like I said, there's two. There's two of a lot of things. There's two domes, there's two trains, there's two of these, uh, minivans here, little buses. Um... Yeah. I'm, I'm just kind of waiting for the little sign that he's somewhere, anywhere, in this specific area. General area. No, that's not it. It's not here. I don't like this. That's the same one. It just circled back around. This is the same dome that was the same little picnic area. I took a wrong turn somewhere. Let's go check the trailer park, I guess. And why is he so mad? What did I do to make him this mad at me to want to kill me? I'm just trying to go home and drive. If you... Help me find the gas canister. I will buy you some McDonald's. You want some chicken nuggies? Have you ever had chicken nuggets? Have you ever had a Happy Meal? You know what? Maybe that's why he's so mad. He's never had a Happy Meal in his life. There he is. You want a Happy Meal? I don't know what the toy is. This could time of the year, but, you know, it's probably something. Creepy fucking music, I ain't having it. And fuck whoever decided to put those fuck- oh, never mind, it was just the star lining up with the tree. It looked like one of those lights, those stadium lights, you know? Basically the same general shape of Siren Head. Oh, I said his name, I'm sorry, Beetlejuice! Oh my god! I won't do it again! God forbid anybody says your name. Who do you think you are, Jesus? Are you serious? Are you fucking with me? Just kidding. Back up, back up, back up. responsibly. I wonder if my mic was able to pick that up. That's funny. Hmm. Where, oh where, could this gas canister be? This really sucks, guys. Like, I'm dead ass 
a little confused here as to where it is. Um, hmm. All right, back to the original plan, which is to check the trailer park. But the last time we did, someone decided to join the search party. Motherfucker. You motherfucker! I was right. I was right. Christ. Okay. You know? I'm feeling much better. Not really. I'm actually a little bit more. <laughs> but it'll be okay. Now that we are aware... And we know what to do. We're gonna wait for him to like come over here, go in the opposite direction, and work our magic. Like we always have. My hand is cramping because of how awkwardly I have to hold down the keys due to these claws. They are ready to come off because I could have ripped off my pinky. Like they're at the length to where if they do get caught on something and they tear, it could take the whole fingernail off. So yeah, it's time to kiss them goodbye. I love them very much, but I'd rather not do that. Okay. I think it's, I think it's time. I don't like going over the hill. I like to see what's beyond, please. He could have the high ground for all I know. Before we reach the final stretch of this game, I wanted to show you guys something. Okay, so, um, so my friend Peanut, he has one of these, uh, plastic glow-in-the-dark skeletons that he got from the dollar store. I have the same, I have the same one that I got last year from the dollar store. And he was, Peanut shows me the skeleton, and he was just like, I was like, look, if we, have, I have the same one. And he's like, well, mine's missing an arm. So I proceeded to rip off all the limbs off the skeleton because they're detachable. I decided to put it back together and I made this monstrosity. And I was looking at it and I was just like, that looks familiar. Who does that look like? So I think I'm gonna make him a head and make it Siren Head because yeah, basically Siren Head is just a bunch of walking bones. Oh, we said his name. Oh shit. Okay, this is for good luck. Cheers, drink responsibly. Okay, here we go. Go, 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 go. We're doing it. Yes, we're out of here. We're gone, baby. We're out of here. Baby mode, I'll take that accomplishment. We did it. Night one. Oh my god, I would die. We escaped. The trouble that came with collecting your car parts, the terror filled in your heart through the journey. You've managed to repair the car, ready for escape. But the loud, booming footsteps ever closer than before. You've never been so terrified in your life. You graciously made the escape, never to return again. You live to tell the tale. You escaped a lot. And that is correct. I'm never coming back. Never coming back. Holy crap, this was so cool. I really liked this game. It really filled me with terror. Because holy shit, this was good. It wasn't scary enough to where I wouldn't come back because look, here we are, we completed it. But that first go around really got my anxiety through the roof. This second time in that we're like, we're used to it, we know what we're doing and where to go, how to 
lay about the, the rules and shit. We're better now. But that first night was really, really, really good. Um, it was so infuriating uh, having to backtrack, backtrack because he's chasing you back into a safe spot or, you know, you die, you gotta start all over again. But I'm glad we were able to do this in one go, one try. We didn't die. We didn't die, which is awesome. I think the last time I played this game, I died like what, five times? And that get that footage was two and a half hours long. This one, how long are we have been here for? An hour and seven minutes. This has been literally nothing compared to what it was last time. So, but I, I wouldn't necessarily say I enjoyed this because I don't enjoy my anxiety peeking through to the point to where I feel like I'm having a stroke because that's how I felt last time. It was so intense, but honestly, take that as a compliment because this is a really good game. Really good game. I had to play on baby mode, which, you know, just kind of sucks. We didn't finish on any of the normal uh, difficulties, so that's probably why we haven't unlocked custom, which is fine. I don't care. So, thank you all everyone so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed Siren Head Awakening. If you have any other non-Siren Head related games you'd like me to try, leave them down in the comments below. As always, uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell option to get notifications about when I post. My social media accounts are all linked in the description below, so make sure you go follow those. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye! Book. <laughs>